So I wanted to um, just quickly show you some really, really simple hand reflexology points that you can use um, just to improve sleep and to manage stress. So the first point is our solar plexus point, which is just right in the centre of the hand. It should be helpful if you almost click up the hand. And then we're just using the, the thumb just to apply pressure into that point. And the solar plexus point is that is a it's a point where we hold all our emotions, where our kind of inner strength comes from that kind of willpower. So we're holding for a count of five and then we're gonna let it go. But as we breathe in, we're gonna press into the point. And as we breathe out, we're gonna let it go. I'm gonna do that three times. So breathing in, pressing into the point. And breathing out, just letting it go. One more time, breathing in, pressing into the point. And breathing out let it go so what we do on one hand we always do in the other so as i was saying solar plexus point is often the point that people most are aware of in their physical body so that knot that you get in your stomach when you're feeling anxious or worried or just a little bit overwhelmed and again then we're going to let it go we're going to take three breaths and as we breathe in we're going to press into the point and as we breathe out we're going to let it go two more press in let it go last time pressing into the point and then letting it go and then we're going to come to the thumb so the thumb is represents our head reflex so if you are bothered with tension headaches or migraines what we're going to do is take just the pad of the index finger and we're just going to begin to roll it all the way over the thumb top of the thumb so this is a point that we would normally work on the big toe. So just for a few moments, just, and you might, in the same way that as we, when we work in reflexology over the points on the feet, sometimes you can feel like a grittiness, or you might even feel like a little pop. And it's just an indication that that's where the body is holding tension, holding stress. So again, we're gonna do it on the other side. So we're right on the top of the thumb. And we're just rolling there on the thumb. So good for tension headaches, good for just if the mind is absolutely full of noise, might be thinking, might be worrying thoughts, might just be 101 different things that we need to do. So bring it to that point. Then we're going to take, just from this knuckle, we're going to take the pad of the other thumb and in reflexology we call it finger walking. So we're going to press and move and we're going to work vertically on the thumb. So working all the way up to the top. So really good for energy that might have migraines. Nice to do just before you go to bed as well, just to settle, settle the mind. Often a good one to do. There's a lot. I know there's a lot of people who hate taking um, paracetamol or anything if they have a headache. So this can be a nice natural way of just releasing tension in the head. So after we've done ver um, vertical passes, we're going to then work horizontally. So again, just in the same movement. Press and move. Press and move. Even better if you can show somebody else to do this and get them to do it for you. So again, we come to the other side. We always balance. Right hand relates to the right side of the body, left hand to the left side of the body. So we always want to find that balance between the right and the left side. So again, we're just going to do the finger walking up through the thumb. Sorry, I know I'm not showing you that very well. So just press and move, press and move all the way up to the top. You might even notice I can feel a little puffy bit there, but I tend, I sometimes notice, particularly on my right side, I hold a lot of tension around my jaw and into my head. So that's probably why I can feel it on this right side. So now I'm working horizontally. Just 
and just to finish that off I'm just going to hold this point again just for a count of three maybe even choosing just to close the eyes breathing nice and slow and steady and then doing that the same on the other side Okay, so that's just a first, so just literally a nice one to use if you have any tension, headaches, migraines, or just to bring a bit of stillness and calmness into the body. So give it a go and let me know how you get on.